Program selection, dialogue, lighthouse. To be a better student and more attractive to future employers, Judy Brewer aimed to become more computer savvy. I wasn't versed on a lot of the software. Being legally blind, she couldn't go just anywhere for training. It's a little bit challenging. But the assistive technology program at the Lighthouse Center for Vision Loss in Duluth gave her everything she needed. The tech people here are amazing and really, really proficient at um, at what they know. The training teaches clients how to use computer programs and other forms of technology with magnification and voice output software. Space band. Space band which helps Judy navigate while seeing and hearing the text on the screen. They taught me the programs that I was kind of interested in knowing, but they also showed me a lot of other things that I wasn't even aware of. This training is all a part of Lighthouse's Employment Readiness Program, a service offered to individuals experiencing all levels of vision loss. To provide them with enough skills and uh, confidence to actively seek gainful employment. They teach clients anything from resume writing to how to address their vision loss with future employers, walking with a cane for transportation and Braille. Students who can use Braille successfully, if they're vision impaired or blind, have a, a better chance of gaining employment than somebody who is not Braille literate. And nationwide, only about 33% of people with a vision loss are employed, making programs like this one desperately needed. I think there can be a hesitancy to work with somebody or employ somebody who has a vision loss or is totally blind. Jim Collins was just 26 years old when he lost his vision to diabetes. Well, I was very unsure at that point. He credits a program like the one offered at Lighthouse combined with hard work for his success. Because of that training, he owns his own vending machine company. It's challenging and it's exciting and it's a lot of fun and it also makes a living. Judy has finished the program at Lighthouse and just graduated from college. So I'm kind of in transition, um, back looking for a job. Not quite sure what the future holds, but she says she is excited and definitely feeling more confident with the technology training under her belt. That I'm excited to actually get out there and, and make things happen. With photojournalist Harry Baker, I'm Maya Holmes, KQDS Fox 21.